marketplace for ideas. Welcome to Aani Market, a short tour for Arkansas for joggers and bikers, and short film of my plans reporting. Let's go and visit Aani Market. Agriculture, Aquaculture, Network International. Dito, marami kayong mabibili talaga. Yung mga daily needs nyo sa kusina, mayroon tayong mga cooked food na galing naman sa magagaling na rin talaga ng mga outlet. This is not only a marketplace for goods, but this is a marketplace for ideas. from Imos Cavite. Actually, I was uh, I was just curious of what is being sold here. Ang food is also affordable and then uh, there are variety of foods to choose among and uh, one of those is my favorite which is the barbecue and the fruits. So that is it for the day. Kasi yung mga kailangan ko nakikita ko dito kasi variety ang nandito eh may prutas may may kakanin may may mga halaman may mga panggamit sa pangsaka eh may maliit din na kung sinasaka kaya interesado ako dito Welcome to Arca South, located at Western Bikutan, Taguig City. Welcome to Arca South Jogging Area. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Tatlo ko ba? Channel ko? Hello. Oh, it's a normal. Come on, check it out. Welcome to my channel. Hello guys, welcome back to Enchan. Hi guys, welcome to Enchan TV 8. Here is Richard and this is Riggs. Jogging tayo guys. So ito po si Chad. Ipa. 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 Ipa.
This is what we do. We run and sweat. So, yun lang naman na activity namin every weekend. So, hindi para magpapaya at hindi para pagpawisan. Dito sa Arca South, this is the perfect place for bikers. This is also a good place for those who wants to play badminton. a nice place para maipasyal ang mga pet dogs. And these places are located at Arca South, Western Dikutan, Taguig City. Here in Arca South, makikita ninyo ang isang building na ito. Ito ay ang Sunshine Mall. Let's do plant repotting. Yan guys, yan ang mint leaves na nabili ko sa Aani Market. So, lilipat ko lang siya sa paso. So, dahan-dahan lang natin tanggalin yung plastic. Para hindi masira yung pinakaugat mo sa ilalim. Ayan guys, ang tanong, can mint leaves be eaten raw? Eating mint leaves in raw form helps protect your body from oxidative stress, 
caused by free radicals, improve brain function, suit digestive disorder, prevent and cure cold symptoms, and reduce bacteria that cause bad breath. Ayun guys, actually itong mint leaves na ito madali lang daw buhayin. So required lang talaga nito ay direct sunlight or full direct sunlight. And guys, pagtripang ko lang magpropagate ng um, mint leaves. So, sa isang jar na yan, make sure may mga patuka yung ganyan na uh, maliliit for drainage. A few coconut husk. Then, saka natin ilagay yung pinaka-stem. Make sure may ugat yung mga mint leaves natin para siguradong mabuhay siya. Another tips guys, kung gusto nyo magpropagate ng mga mint leaves, yung mga stem na ito ay pwede nyo ibabad sa puti. After 3 to 4 days, makakaroon na siya ng ugat. So pwede mo na siyang itanin kagaya nito.
Ito ang aglaw nema na nabili ko sa Aani Market. Ito naman ang mint leaves. Ayan guys, ito naman ang aglaw nema. So, nabili ko to sa Arani Market na worth 100 each. So, mura na actually. So, kaya ng mint leaves, dahan-dahan lang din natin tanggalin yung plastic bago natin ilipat sa paso para buo yung pinakailalim na at hindi masira yung pinakaugat na. Aglaw Nema is one of the most stylish, relatively new variety to the houseplant world. This stunner shows off dark green leaves, elegantly flush with bright red or pink. Its colorful foliage makes red Aglaw Nema a perfect home decor accent. guys, tips lang. How do you take care of the red aglow nema plants? The red aglow nema plants prefers to be kept moist during the spring and summer. But make sure the soil isn't soggy. Moderation is the key. Do not allow the lower soil to remain wet as this may cause root rot. In the winter, water thoroughly but allow the soil to dry out between waterings. Another tips guys, does aglow nema need sunlight? Green varieties of aglow nema can tolerate low light, but the variegated ones will maintain their luster in medium to bright, in direct sunlight. They should never be placed in direct sunlight. They can grow under fluorescent lightning, making them ideal for offices and interior low light spaces. Very very careful lang kasi buo ang mga ugat niyan sa ilalim. So, para hindi masira yung ilalim. So, very very careful.
actually sabi nila ang aglaw nema is a common called Chinese evergreen that brings luck ornamental plants in Asia for centuries. Ang benefits din ito is it is best air purifier plants that's shown to clean out for a mild height and then sing from the air in the home and offices. Ayan guys, nalipat na natin ang mint leaves sa paso, gaya nito. Pero hindi talaga siya advisable sa indoor guys. Ito ang peace lily. Kapag nakita nyo ang dahon niya ay naging ganito, pagsak siya at sag, ibig sabihin, kailangan mo na siyang diligan. Mabilis lang siyang mag-revive, about an hour or two, tatayo ang kanyang mga dahon agad-agad. To revive it, water the soil and moisten the leaves or spray it. The best care you can give to your peace lily is to water it attentively. Ayan guys, sinetop ko yung camera para makita ko yung pagre-revive ng isang peace lady. I use the camera with a speed up of 5 times using the time lapse and I shoot it for 3 hours. How often should I water my peace lily indoors? One of the great advantage in caring for the peace lily is the fact that it sag a bit when it needs water, essentially telling when you it's thirsty. In general, water at least once a week and keep the soil moist.
Should I miss my peace lily? Peace lily are more tolerant of underwatering than overwatering. Keep plants evenly moist by watering the soil, fields, try to the touch. Peace lily leaves also enjoy a good misting, which you can do when you water throughout the summer. Another tips guys are coffee ground wood for peace lily. Peace lilies prefer a soil with a pH of 5.8 to 6.5 which is considered acidic as in anything under 7. Choose coffee grounds to suit your peace lily just fine. Ayan guys, almost nakikita na natin na ang peace lily natin ay almost revived na. So about a few hours to go, about one hour more, full revived na ito.